Let me, let me ask you, I mean, when you, when you say that or when you're talking to these, these folks that, that maybe don't want to get signed to a major label anymore, do they still have the same goals that artists coming up 10 years ago had? In other words, do they want to be on radio? Do they want to have hits on radio? Or maybe they're just looking at their careers a whole different way. Uh, I, I, I tend to find that they're dealing mostly with creativity, demonstrating their creativity, being individuals, and really not thinking about radio and kind of, it's, there's almost, um, and I work with the kids from Out of Future, I work with Frank Ocean, a gentleman who really made his way kind of on his own, uh, so to speak. And it's, it's just for him, it's just about being, you know, speaking uh, as someone who knows him, it's about being himself and getting out his ideas kind of at, by any means necessary. But Frank Ocean's on a major label. Right, but if you watch, if you look at his tweet prior to the, um, uh, right, right after Nostalgia Ultra came out, he was all about, by the way, y'all, the label slept on me. I did this on my own. He made that, it was a very emphatic statement that kind of shook things up a little bit. So he's there, but the, his mentality still is in another place, is in that place of kind of independence and. Okay, fair enough. I mean, 